In this video, I will show you how you can connect GoDaddy domain to Framer. So first of all, you need to simply launch the Framer onto your web browser. Then you just need to make sure to publish your particular site. So simply select the project that you want to publish and then click on publish on the top right and then click on add domain. Now this is where you need to click on connect a domain but you need to have a upgrade plan in order for you to add your own custom GoDaddy domain. Just to show you the process you just need to put your domain name. You need to replace your DNS records with the Framer DNS records which are provided below in the configure a domain section. So in order to do this you just need to head over to domains then click on manage DNS and now click on the add new record. The first one will going to be a record and if I go back we have all the details given right here. For the a record we can either type the name which is our full domain name or we can simply go for the add the rate. Simply put it just like so. As for the value we need to copy this value and then we need to paste it in the value section and then click on save. Once we have added one A record, it's now time to add our C name. Now select the C name by clicking on add A record again. And then for the name, you can simply type www. And as for the name or value, we need to type sites.framer.app. Once you type this, simply click on save and you are good to go. It might take few minutes to activate your domain on your framer, so make sure to give it at least 48 hours so that's the way of how you can connect your godaddy domain to your framer website